Hello everyone, my name is Emily, and today I'm going to take my Take the Plunge on the go trio and head out on an adventure. I'm going to leave three pieces of artwork around Omaha, Nebraska for some of you guys to find. If you live near the Omaha area and are interested in finding these pieces, please make sure that you respect the establishments I left them in and make sure to buy something while you're there. I definitely didn't want to vandalize any of these places or put the artwork somewhere that was difficult to get to, so I just put the pieces in a little baggie and left them somewhere easily accessible. First stop is the Omaha Public Library, Milton R. Abrams Branch on 90th and Fort. There are several really cool Omaha Public Library locations, but this one was near where I was headed anyway, so I just went right in. Ooh, big spiky ball. I had no idea what I was going to paint, so I just went basic level Emily with like bones and flowers and whatnot. I stuck this cute little guy right in the poetry section inside a collection of Chaucer's poetry on page 375. There's no significance to this book or the page number. It just stood out to me because it was very stately looking and the page was just the number I opened up to. <laughs> I'm so exciting. Make sure that if you visit, you sign up for a library card if you don't already have one. Mm, bye, Spiky Ball. Next stop is Bed Bath & Beyond. <laughs> I am not even kidding. Here in Omaha, we have a really cool little shopping park called Exarban Village, and that's where I was generally headed for my next stop, but then I saw there was a B, B, and B here, and I had to skirt, skirt, and head over. But first, I had a delicious brunch at the First Watch Cafe. I was so busy trying to keep my painting from flying away because it was like so windy that day. So my dumbass forgot to take like a video of my beautiful French toast that I had ordered. Oh well, it was delicious either way. I also got so caught up in painting that I didn't realize they had closed. <laughs> And I was the last person sitting in their little like outdoor seating area, so I had to bounce. I did apologize to the wait staff, but they seemed totally unbothered because, you know, I was outside, so it's not like I was impeding their closing rituals or anything. I headed over to the B B and B and hid this cute little guy back in the bed section under the mattress of the bed in the far back left corner of the store. Right now they have a pink duvet with matching pillowcases on it. And please do not lift up the mattress mattress. You should be able to just gently put your fingers underneath and pull the artwork out. If you don't feel anything, someone might have already found it, so keep that in mind. Make sure to pick up some cute new stuff for your home while you're there, even if it's something small, like a snack. Next stop is the Michaels on 72nd Street, near where 72nd and Dodge intersect. I got so sidetracked while I was here, clearly. I decided to buy a few new canvases to paint some artwork for my baby, as well as some acrylic molding paint so I can add some interesting textures to whatever I decide to paint him. I went over to where Michaels displays their cricket machines, opened the purple crickets accessory hatch, and as it turns out, this cute little guy fit right inside. Hopefully you guys can find all these pieces. If you find a piece, make sure to post a picture on Instagram and tag me. I'd love to see who finds them. Next time, I'm definitely going to stick to exclusively outdoor places so we don't need to get businesses involved in any way again. Though if you are a local Omaha business and would like me to leave some artwork at one of your locations, please feel free to reach out on Twitter or through my business email located in the description down below. I got a lot of compliments on my cute Take the Plunge trio, so if you guys are interested in picking up one or all of the set, go to www.crowdmade.com slash collections slash Emily Artful to get yours today. If you get all three, you get 15% off your entire purchase. There's only one day left before they disappear, so go grab them while you can. And don't forget, I'm donating 50% of the proceeds to rain. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to stay out of trouble. See you guys later.